So today we're going to learn how to play January by Pilot and it starts with a C9 chord. So it's in the key of F if you think of it as the dominant going into the, the root. So it's on the E on the 8th fret, it's on the D on the 8th fret, the G on the 7th and the B on the 8th. So you're getting that sound. And then the lick playing over it is... So you can hear that, it's kind of F major E melody. Obviously, if you were playing on an electric guitar, you're bending on the 13th on the B up to the 15th. So 10 on the B, 12 on the G to 10. Okay, then we get into the verse. I'll play the verse and then I'll explain the chords. January, sick and tired, you've been hanging on me. You make me sad with your eyes. They're telling me lies. Don't go, don't go. Okay. Not the greatest singer in the world. <laughs> so, it starts with an F in the C position. So that is on the A string on the 8th fret, the D string on the 7th fret, the G string on the 5th, and the B string on the 6th. To a B flat major 7, which I play like this. It's the E string on the 6th, you leave out your A string, and then on the 7th on the D, 7th on the G, and 6th on the B. You're getting that sound. So F, B flat major 7, A minor with your bar chord, which is just barring the 5th fret, and then you're holding on the A string on the 7th and the D string on the 7th. Okay, so so far F major, B flat major 7, A minor, or A minor 7 if you want to play to C minor, which is barring from the A string down on the third fret, then you're holding on the D string on the fifth, the G string on the fifth, and then on the fourth fret of your B string. Okay, to a D7, which I play like this, on the A string on the fifth, on the D string on the fourth, the G string on the fifth, and the B string on the third, to a G minor, which is just barring your third fret, and uh, then you're playing on the A string on the fifth, the D string on the fifth, and then a B flat minor six, which is the sixth fret of your E, you're leaving out your A string, and then the fifth fret of your D, sixth fret, sixth fret of the G, sixth fret of the B. Okay, so so far, because there's a lot of chords, F major, B flat major seven, A minor, C minor, D7, G minor, B flat minor 6, that's how far we've gotten, A minor, we've done already, and then here we have a nice interesting chord, which is a, a C11 chord, which is the 10th, no it's a D11 chord, I beg your pardon. <laughs> so it's the 10th fret of the E string, it's the 10th fret of your D string, ninth fret on your G string and eighth fret on your B. So A minor, D11, G minor, C11. Exact same chord, you're just moving it down two frets. So the whole verse progression again, F major, B flat major seven, da da and A minor, C minor, D, D seven, G minor, B flat minor six, and then the don't go, don't go, don't go, and again January. Da 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 da. -da. You can hear it. You make me sad. Come and see. Do 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 do. Don't go, don't go. Now. Where we play C11 there the last time, we go from our C11 to our C9, which is our intro chord that we've already gone over, which plays the opening melody again. And we go into our second verse. Now our second verse is slightly different. We play, I'll play it and then explain it. Life gets me higher. I don't 
profess to know all of the lyrics. Okay. So again, we start with our F in the C position. We know that already. We're going to play a D minor, which is barring from the A string on the 5th fret down. We're holding the D string on the 7th, the G string on the 7th, and the B string on the 6th. Moving that down 2 frets, we have C minor. We know this already. We've done our D7. Okay, we've done this chord already. G minor, we've done already. A minor, we know it already. And then if we move that up, uh, it's a B flat, barring the whole 6th fret. Holding the A on the 8th, the D on the 8th, and the G on the 7th. Hold the same position, but if we just move from the 6th on the E to the 8th on the E, we have C11, which we've done already. So the whole progression for the second verse. Life gets me D minor, C minor, D7, G minor, the world A minor. Got a D flat major to a C11, and it goes again. Sun like a fire. Carry on. Da, 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 da. Let's watch it. Now, and we go back to our C9. You'll hear him, he goes to the really high notes. You've been chasing the world, which I'm not going to attempt to sing. You've been chasing the world. Goes back into. What we've done already, F, B flat major 7, A minor, C minor, B7, G minor, B flat minor 6, A minor, D11, G minor, C11. That's pretty much it. The only thing that is different is on the electric guitar, you'll hear uh, in the second verse, when he's going up from G minor, A minor, B flat to C11. You hear these little licks, obviously he plays it a lot faster than that on an acoustic, I'm not going to attempt it, but it's basically just outlining a G minor chord. So. I think anyone with an ear can kind of hear that. That's pretty much it, that's the whole song. Um, if you have any feedback or if you think I've gotten any of the chords wrong, let me know. Cheers. Thank you.